What's happening, everybody? This is Pirate Stacker coming at you Thursday, September 3rd. Or it might be the 4th. I'm not sure. Anyway, good to see you all today. Thanks for watching. We did upgrade, and we do got this fancy schmancy holder for my phone, although now that I'm looking at it, it's pretty close. So I don't know if that's going to work or not. Let me know what you think of this setup. And uh, we'll film a few videos with it, see if we need to look for something else. Uh, today, we are opening. We got a package. And the box is too big, so... Man, apparently everything's too big with this. <laughs> so, let's get right into it. Uh, I did also want to say at the beginning of my video... Uh, if you've been watching a bit and you like what you see, please hit the subscribe button. Give me a like, leave a comment, that would be awesome. So I got this order here from, uh, I think it was Provident, or Providence, uh, a bullion dealer I hadn't dealt with before, a couple of airtight capsules, no big deal, but I had showed you this little gem, this Monarch, five troy ounces, chunky. And uh, I really liked that, so I thought I would get some more of their pieces. So I just got a couple of things here. And uh, these are little one-ounce bars, which now that I'm seeing them, I love them. So they're really small. Sorry, it takes a second for me to get the hang of this. They're really small, one ounce, one troy ounce, Monarch Precious Metals, 0.999 fine silver. And you can see, I mean, that's the size of a finger. So it's definitely smaller than your press bars that you normally would see. I have a couple of those because I thought they might be kind of neat. I actually need to find the, uh, they didn't have the two ounce when I was looking. So here's two of the one ounces. Kind of cool. I like it. Hopefully that didn't just blur the screen. My battery's low. <laughs> so those are pretty neat. I dig that. Much smaller than the rounds. You can see that. And then I got this sweet little deal. Also from Monarch. Man, it's a furry pouch. See that there? That is our Yeti, yes. One of 999, apparently. Let's get into this thing. Oof, nice and heavy. We got a Yeti. And I guess these are hand poured. Or I don't know exactly how. Looks like I got number 898 of a limited edition. And it does say three troy ounces, 0.999 fine silver, limited edition, Yeti. So that's pretty cool. I dig it. The Yeti. And then they sent me this furry little pouch. <laughs> the furry little Yeti pouch to put it in. Monarch Precious Metals. That's a real leather pouch. Look at that fits right inside perfect all right so I'm gonna say it that is a pretty awesome piece I dig it oh and the whole backside's fur <laughs> I don't know what kind of hair that is but that's pretty rad holy smokes Yeti bag with my three ounce collectible so this kind of goes to what I was talking about in a previous video. So I'm looking to pick up a couple of collectible pieces. Now, I don't know that this is going to go up in value. I think I ended up paying 110 on this, which obviously that's a bit more than spot. But holy smokes, the cool factor is definitely there. That is a neat, neat piece. And I think once they sell out, I think people will... I kind of think they want one. Who knows? I dig it. I don't I don't actually know that I can part with it. This is where I wish I had the money to pick up three or four of them. <laughs> it 
so that I could actually uh, keep one and sell a couple off to broaden my stack. So that is pretty awesome. The Yeti, guys. I guess it's time. It's never too early for rum, right? That's what they say. Cheers, guys. Drink them if you got them. Mm-hmm. Tasty. Woo! So anyway, uh, let me know what you think about my new setup. Monarch Precious Metals. Uh, I'm going to be honest. I'm, I'm a fan. I think they got my interest. These fat little stacks. I think these are uh, probably worth having a premium for. Something that I could probably flip for more. Although, this just makes me want to collect more pieces of theirs. Just for my own collection and collectability. Pretty nice. Uh, if any of you guys use Monarch Precious Metals, let me know what your thoughts are on it. And uh, let me know what you think about these little... These little gems, man, they're pretty neat. Pretty cool. Also, tell me what you think about the uh, camera setup. Is it too big? Is it too close? Zoomed in. We got too much, too many hands. <laughs> it's a little low. It's a little hard to work around. It's definitely different than, uh, than when I'm back and kind of, it's a different angle. I lost my treasure chest and my pirate hat, all my, all my fun goodies, but if everybody likes this, we'll we'll roll with this sort of shot for a bit. But the Yeti, man, three ounces. Beautiful. That is a beautiful piece. Beautiful and limited. 898 of 999. I wish I could have gotten, like, number 999 or number one. Those would be pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. Now this one doesn't say Monarch Precious Metals. It just has a picture of their crown logo. But uh, but I guess the Yeti bag does have the MPM on it. M fur. Silver. Fur. Best combo ever. Alright, I'm rambling. But uh, anyhow... We do have, uh, I did get a scale and some other cool stuff. We'll, we'll do a video on that tomorrow. And, uh, man, if there's anything you guys want to talk about, let me know. Otherwise, I'm just plowing through the things I like to talk about. And, obviously, this these metals are a nice little pickup. So, you guys have a great day today. Keep stacking. Uh, of course, this was just kind of a review of some of my new product, Mail Day. But, uh... I'm not a financial advisor, obviously. I'm a pirate, so don't take my advice. But uh, Monarch Precious Metals, they get a thumbs up. They get two thumbs up from me. I dig them. Very cool stuff here. So have a great day. We will talk to you all tomorrow. Pirate out. <laughs>